I guess the thing now is just uh, it's not the, the snow or, or the cold. It's just this fog that's out there. Yeah, and the good news about this fog is it's because it's warmer out there. Yes, right? it is warmer, <laughs> and it's wet. You know, we, it was so wet yesterday, yeah. and that's why this is in my throat. I wondered. Yeah, you, you okay? Yeah, I'm very white, yeah, man. that's right, baby. <laughs> oh, baby. Well, we've got a lot to talk about, so let's get right to it now. Uh, we've got a crew headed down to Columbus. I've asked them if they can to fire up their dash cam oh, yeah. uh, as, as they head down. This is a look at Plainfield, and notice just how dense this fog is outside of the airport. Remember, this is Plainfield Middle School, so it's, it's just to the west of Indianapolis International. This is another look. Down on the ground here, 465 in Michigan, we're okay, but you can see this fog now starting to settle in on the city's north side. Visibility readings are bad. They're going to get worse one mile. Indy, Shelbyville, over to Greencastle. Uh, a couple of times I've seen Shelbyville and Greencastle click over to zero, so that means there are some pretty dense fog banks. I think the big problem here would be uh, 74 going from Brownsburg out and then 74 from Indy all the way to Cincinnati this morning. So we're going to see fog for several hours today with some sun breaking out later on today. I think the afternoon will be nice, but because we have this fog now, I do not see us getting out of the 40s and yes, <clears throat> Excuse me, it's going to be wet tomorrow. Right now, 39 in Kokomo, 37 Greencastle. So we're not looking for ice fog. That would be, that would not be good, would it? 41 here in the state capitol. So right now, we're running 5 degrees warmer than yesterday in Shelbyville, about 11 degrees warmer than yesterday at this time. Well, as we go through the day today, we're going to hang in the 30s all morning long by the noon hour up to 46, and then the sun breaks out at least a little bit. I'm calling for an afternoon high right around 49 as the sun sets. Here's a look at our future track. Let's put it in motion. A lot of cloud cover today, but that breaks this afternoon. So we'll see at least some sunshine. Then here comes a front. This is 7 o'clock tomorrow. Widespread rain. We're going to see a couple of heavy downpours with this. This is 9.30 tomorrow, 11 o'clock. On the back side of this, we'll have some rain start to fill in. So this may not be totally out of here till 7 o'clock tomorrow night. And that paves the way for a really cool Friday and Saturday. So here we go. 49 today, 42 tonight, 56 tomorrow. So that's the good news, but it will be wet. And then 44 Friday, only 40 degrees on Saturday. I think we're going to struggle to get out of the 30s. We'll see rain and snow. And finally, as we go back into next week, we're looking for a bit of a warm-up, but it's going to be about a week from today before we see that. Huh.